नमस्कार आई अमित कुमार वेलकम यू ऑल इन आई एम डेज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो इफ यू लुक एट द ऑब्जर्व रेनफॉल विच हैज बीन रिपोर्टेड टूडे देन यू कैन सी दैट हैवी टू वेरी हैवी विद एक्सट्रीमली हैवी रेनफॉल्स इज रिकॉर्डेड ओवर सम पार्ट्स ऑफ सब हिमालयन वेस्ट बेंगाल एंड कोंकन एंड गोवा सो ओवर कोंकन एंड गोवा एज यू मे रिमेंबर दैट ये स्टडे देर वॉज ए साइक्लोनिक सर्कुलेशन इवन ए लो प्रेशर एरिया रेमिनेंट ऑफ लो प्रेशर एरिया विच वॉज प्रिवेलिंग ओवर नॉर्थ तेलंगाना दैट हैज बिकम लो लेस मार्क टूडे बट द एसोसिएटेड साइक्लोनिक सर्कुलेशन इज स्टिल प्रिवेलिंग ओवर वेस्ट ईस्ट विदर्भा देन वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल वॉज रिकॉर्डेड ओवर उत्तराखंड ईस्ट उत्तर प्रदेश असम मेघालय गेंगेटिक वेस्ट बेंगाल झारखंड बिहार तेलंगाना एंड कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश सो यू कैन सी दैट दे आर टू डिफरेंट सेक्टर्स इन विच वेरी हैवी एंड हैवी रेनफॉल वॉज रिकॉर्डेड वन वॉज ओवर ईस्ट एंड नॉर्थ ईस्ट इंडिया एंड द अदर वन वॉज ओवर नॉर्थ पेनसुलर इंडिया एंड एडजोइनिंग पार्ट्स ऑफ सेंट्रल इंडिया so now uh, if we look at today's synoptic systems uh, then there is as i have already told you that there is a cyclonic circulation uh, in lower to middle tropospheric levels which is prevailing over east vidarbha uh, under we, whose and it is tilting southwestward with height so under its influence it is likely that maharashtra will get uh, ex- uh, uh, extremely heavy rainfall in some parts and then uh, heavy to very heavy rainfall in uh, few of the regions of maharashtra today then there is a cyclonic circulation over east bihar also uh, uh, under whose influence heavy to very heavy rainfall is likely over bihar jharkhand and uh, neighboring parts of uh, east india then over northeast india there are two cyclonic circulation one over central assam in lower troposphere and one in uh, over mizoram in middle uh, lower to middle tropospheric levels under whose influence the entire northeast may get uh, uh, very heavy rainfall today so uh, our highlights for today is uh, presentation weather systems are that uh, heavy to very heavy rainfall is likely over many more uh, over Uh, parts of northeast india uh, india and maharashtra during next 2 to 3 days and uh, over konkan and madhya maharashtra there is a possibility of extremely heavy rainfall also today now uh, as you are seeing that uh, the monsoon withdrawal line then it continues to pass through shriganganagar nagaur jodhpur and barmer and the conditions are becoming favorable for uh, withdrawal from more some more parts of rajasthan and some parts of punjab in next two days now if you look at the uh, day wise uh, warnings then for today that is on 15th of september the uh, map which you are seeing on your screen is uh, valid till 8:30 ist of uh, 16th of september so you can see that as i have already told you that red warning is issued for konkan and um, uh, ghat areas of madhya maharashtra for extremely heavy rainfall then orange color warning is issued for very heavy rainfall over Ma- marathwada now you can see that under the influence of this upper air cyclonic circulation uh, parts of uh, central india comprising of uh, vidarbha madhya pradesh uh, madhya uh, vidarbha and madhya pradesh and then parts of north uh, peninsular india comprising of some parts of chatisgarh telangana nik and rayalseema and cap that is coastal andhra pradesh uh, will get heavy rainfall warning and hence a yellow color warning is issued for it uh, under the influence of cyclonic circulation over east india you can see that uh, orange color very heavy warnings are issued for east uttar pradesh bihar jharkhand and sub himalayan west bengal entire northeast is also issued for orange color have very heavy rainfall warnings now if we talk about north india then uh, very heavy rainfall warnings are issued for uttarakhand and heavy rainfall warnings are issued for himachal pradesh now if we look for day 2 that is 16th of uh, uh, september warnings then in this map you can see that as the cyclonic circulation over east vidarbha that will be moving somewhat towards the coast so the rainfall activity is likely to decrease over maharashtra and hence orange color very heavy warning is issued for konkan madhya 
Maharashtra and Marathwada. For the adjoining regions of Vidarbha, uh, Chhattisgarh, Telangana and Naike, heavy rainfall warnings are issued. Over East India, you can see that the orange warnings for very heavy rainfall over Bihar and Jharkhand and Sabimal and West Bengal will continue on 16th of September also. For Northeast also, very heavy warning will continue for Arunachal Pradesh and heavy warning will continue for Assam Meghalaya and Nagaland. Uh, over uh, uh, North India, heavy wo rainfall warning will continue for Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand. Now, uh, over Tamil Nadu, if you you can see that for the next five days, that is from 15th of uh, September onwards, heavy rainfall warning at isolated places is issued. Now, if we look at the warnings for 17th of September, then you can see that very heavy rainfall activity will continue over Sabimal in West Bengal, over entire Northeast also the very heavy rainfall warning will continue. If you come to West India, then you can see that the rainfall activity will be decreasing over Konkan, Goa, Konkan, Madhya Maharashtra and Marathwada and only heavy rainfall warnings are issued. Uh, but uh, rainfall activity is likely to increase over with isolated heavy falls over Telangana, Andhra Pradesh and Karnataka on 17th of September. Now if you look at the warnings for 18th of September then uh, you can see that the rainfall activity will decrease over West India with heavy rainfall warning over Konkan and Goa. Then rainfall activity over Northeast will continue from 18th to 20th of September uh, and isolated heavy rainfalls uh, will continue. Over East uh, Uttar Pradesh and Bihar and Jharkhand also that is over the East India also uh, rainfall activity will continue on 18th and 19th of September. You can join us on our Mosum web page, Mosum app and on our social media platforms where you will be updated with latest weather information. Namaskar Jai Hind.